To speed up our work, we can make a library of 3D models and materials. Then we can bring them easily with Asset Browser. Let's open Asset Browser. Click here to see the list of assets we added. Just drag the objects into the scene. It will snap to the grid or to the objects. We can also bring materials and will be applied to the object's material slot. You can get these assets from my Gumbroad. Let's take a look at how to add the folders with assets in Preferences, File Paths, Asset Libraries. I have these folders where the assets were saved. If we click the plus button, we can add a new folder. So basically, we need to save the blend file inside a folder and then add the folder here. But let's see how to set the assets. I'm going to use ANT landscape and not Wrangler add-ons. This is just to create the terrain and to add the textures. Once enabled, Shift A, Mesh, Landscape. In Presets, I'm going to use Large Terrain. To add the textures, open Shader Editor and create a material. We can download free textures from polyhaven.com, ambientcg, or textures.com. Now select the shader, press Ctrl Shift T and look for the textures. Hold down Ctrl and select Color, Roughness and Normal. If there's a metallic texture, we also have to select it, but this is not the case, so click here. And now to see the textures, in edit mode, press U and click and grab. In the outliner, right click and mark as asset. Now we can see this new icon or go to object, asset, mark as asset and also we can clear the asset. To create a material library, make sure to select the object, head over material properties, right click, and again mark as asset. Now let's save the file. I have a folder named Asset Browser. Inside this folder I have subfolders with my blend files. So let's create a new folder. Name it. And save the file inside this folder. If we open the Asset Browser, now we can see the assets in current file but we want the assets listed here so let's open a new file in file paths libraries add the folder we just created name the library and save the preferences Again, open Asset Browser, 
And now the assets are listed here. And that's it.